The superlative form for adjectives shows the difference among three or more things. For example, if I have a watermelon, I can say the watermelon is big. And with two things, here's a plum, I can say the watermelon is bigger than the plum. And then I'm using the comparative form. If I have three things, I have a watermelon, a plum, and here's a grape. The watermelon is biggest, or the watermelon is the biggest of the three things. The grape is the smallest. Adjectives that are two syllables or longer form the superlative differently. Let's take the adjective expensive. Expensive has three syllables, expensive. In the comparative form, more expensive, if we look at the difference between two things, and if we look at the difference among three things, and we use the word expensive to describe a noun, then we say it is the most expensive. This watermelon cost $5.99. The plum was about 40 cents. And the grape, well, I got this in a bunch that cost uh, two or three dollars a pound. So this one grape might be a few pennies in, different, in cost. So the watermelon is the most expensive of the three things that I purchased. There are three different ways to make the superlative form. If a word is one syllable in length, then you add EST to the end of the word and use the article the. Hard becomes the hardest. Two syllables ending in Y will change the Y to an I. Busy becomes the busiest. Noisy becomes the noisiest. And for long words, two syllables or more, there's difficult. Difficult is three syllables. Use most. The most difficult. If the word is comfortable, comfortable has four syllables, and you say the most comfortable. There are also some irregular adjectives, such as good and bad. To make the superlative from good, use best, the best. And for bad, use worst, the worst. There's also far. Far becomes the farthest. In this case, you have to add the th.